Help me. Oh, there he is. Her sing is too powerful. But if you spare me, I can be a powerful ally to you. And I would promise to never return to civilized life. I know now that I can't live among people. I already know what time it is, but this the game studios presents Skyrim. Now listen, listen. Every time you hear this, oh man, but this the game studios presents Skyrim. I know you see that but Bruh. The studio down there. Anyway, every time you hear this intro, the literal fire that comes from it you immediately know, out of nostalgia, somebody about to pop off, and it's me. That's it. That's how I feel. <laughs> I love playing Skyrim, man, because there's so many ideas, different paths you can take when you play this game. Continuing with the last playoff, we was making our way to getting the one armor piece I'm going to need to help start my character up. Right now, her magic ain't doing good. I mean, it, it's, a, it's not beefy, you know? We're just starting off, and she's she's just a healer right now. When I get a little bit more into the character, I'll explain her story plot, and you know what she does in the lore of Skyrim. I always try to put my character bases based in the lore of Skyrim. I can't really help it; it's just how I am. Now we had just freed that vampire guy. It'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier world. with a belly full of mead. How you um, so let's go take a look into our quest. I'll meet by moonlight. I have to kill the great beast after I had gotten through speaking to Sending. I met with Sending a werewolf who the Daedric Lord Hearsing has punished by preventing his transformations. He's given me a ring he stole and asked me to. Entreat? You're saying for forgiveness. Alright, so let's go entreat here saying for forgiveness. But the only way we're going to be able to do that is find this great elk creature and kill it. And I'm going to use the map. I'm going to look around a little bit. Okay. So I had made my way to this creature. <coughs> and it was supposed to be the white stag I was supposed to hunt. Very tough creature, especially if you're melee bound. I wanted to just melee it and kill it, but it ran away, and I had to use bow and sneak to kill it. I'm just not advanced with magic, so anything I would have done to it, he just would have ran off, and then it would have furthered my troubles. Because if I ran to enemies like you see later on, it makes this a whole lot worse. We have a lot of ingredients that I have not been messing with. Sir, no run. That, that makes this a lot harder because catching you is impossible. I'm supposed to shoot you with a bow, but I'm, I'm not going to get this melee. I'm not going to lie to you. I'll have to chase you around this whole area. I already know it. You know, I feel like this is going to bring me to a bit bad. Now sneaking up on your enemies is a good way to actually do critical damage. It's pretty much another way of catching them off guard. You cannot crit with magic unless it is a melee bound summon or something like that. There's no way to crit with magic at all. But magic has several things it's super effective to. Fire against ice and that's pretty much it. I mean electricity doesn't do anything but drain one's you know magicka and stamina down. So, in its own, it's got its strengths, but also have its weaknesses. If magic crit in the destruction tree, it'd be very broken. Um, my character is restoration bound, so she doesn't have any combat spells as of yet. But, she's good at survivability, and that's going to be seen later on. Especially when I fight this werewolf upcoming. Anyway, this white elk. I should have never. And Sam's hell. What are you doing over here? I don't know why you want to do that. I'll pay you a 
any idea how fast I'm running. Oh, I can no. oh. start dying. Get out of here. You see, I was in the middle of this. What were you thinking? I mean, I'll keep the Nord me right now, and that's a steel weapon, so I'm taking it. Matter of fact, now interrupt my hunt again, somebody. I dare them. I don't like to deal with bows. Bows are great in this game. Very overpowered, in my opinion. Is that it? Just standing up now. That's not it. Yeah. Oh my. What did I just step on? Darn bear trap. That means he was over here chillaxing by himself. Yeah, he was minding his own business. I'm gonna have to take a little detour. Hey, that light armor jump is exactly what I'm gonna need. This potion, you can't go wrong with it. There's a chest that needs to be unlocked. Nice. And I'm not gonna lie to you, I love me some Skyrim, don't get me wrong. But this quest in particular can be a pain in the butt if you don't. What's that there? <laughs> See, guys, I forgot that if you sneak up on certain bandit camps, things like to go down in the worst way. People. You value your life in the right now. It's nothing! Death is high. Oh. Oh. You Your Andros near. Oh. Oh. just does more damage as one of right now. You'll be so much easier to rob when you're dead. Oh. 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 Healthy kill. All right. I'm gonna take the gold with the rest of that stuff. I might as well take the arrows too, considering I'm gonna be chasing the deer creature around. There he is. I need that to increase no matter what I do. The lock pick. Now, now that that's done and out of the way. Take a Alright, I see the Great Elk up there, just because I used to use bows, and I have a further sight. I don't know if I'm actually about to land a hit, but... Bruh. Shooting slightly above your target helps with its reach. Bruh. Sometimes, because I mean, right now... It's pretty... okay. I'm not getting much of a hit there. I swear to God, if you miss one more time, I'm gonna be real mad. My target, or no, it's just sitting there. Yeah, there we go. White Stag actually heals himself after being hit. Very annoying. Oh All right, it didn't go down. The White Stag is what I needed. It's the spirit of piercing reincarnate. Well met, Hunter. That's all. I am the spirit of the hunt. Just one glimpse of the glorious stalker that your kind calls her scene. That's right. What would you ask of me here? Your fealty is precious to me. I will make good use of it. Okay. You bear my ring. Yes, I do. The one who stole it has fled to what he thinks is his sanctuary. Just as a bear climbs a tree to escape the hunt, but only ends up trapping himself. Hmm. Seek out this rogue shifter. Tear the skin from his body and make it an offering to me. Okay. It shall be done. Fly, my hunter. There are others who vie for my favor. A bit of competition. Don't dally while the prey flees. Okay, okay. So I've been given the tax to kill the Great Beast, which is that werewolf guy, because I'm pretty 
pretty sure he's someone that ah, found you. No, sir. You need to do better than that. I'm right by Riverwood, and this is the place where I would go storyline plot wise. So, yes, it's good to discover it. But bandits are also indigenous to this area. I don't know. I don't know. That was a problem for everyone. I'm gonna leave. I just don't see that. It's like the, the pimp acts of the gods. Anyway, that's a pretty rare ingot to drop. Ingots that are dropped normally are used for just customizing armor sets. Let's deal with. I said deal twice, but these guys hate when we get too close to them. Yeah, that, that hammer is a hammer. Hold on, hold on, sir. I don't like hearing that sound as much as you. There's blood here and there's a skeleton, which is a good indication that that werewolf may be here. But regardless of which, something popped up and I couldn't see what it was. It was just like the bone. Or... Oh. Yeah. No material I might use. Loaded Man's Grotto Discovered is where I would have needed to go. There's a lot of blood. Lots of it. I'm only level 5. This werewolf guy might be tough. A little bit too tough. Hmm. We'll see though. already bodied a few people. Take it. A steel sword. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We up to something. Um. Um. Iron sword. I got to go. I got my steel sword. I don't care. What are you people. doing that for? Man, you better shut up, bro. Has the blood moon called you, fellow hunter? Uh, it's daylight outside. There is no moon here. Uh, uh there is a moon here. How? The prey is strong. Stronger than the hunters, but more will come. Bring him down for the glories of Lord Hirsin. My boy, if I didn't talk to you, probably wouldn't have died. Just decided to body himself. Well, for now, he has leather armor, and it was way better than what I was wearing, right? The leather armor. I'm actually gonna wear this hood for now because it's gonna help me with my magical, 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 max, you know, max out magic stuff. I'll tell you what I'm talking about. <laughs> Long story short, you see on the bottom left where it says Magica, when I put that helmet on, it actually gives me more Magica, so I can cast my healing stuff a little bit more, which I'm gonna need in this fight. Right you why? And I would deserve it, wouldn't I? I can't stop you if that's what you want to do. Oh, there is. Her is too powerful. But if you spare me, I can be a powerful ally to you. And I would promise to never return to civilized life. I know now that I can't live among people. I will spare you life. Thank to God. Now let's deal with these other hunters. We hunt together. <laughs> Jokes on you. I just like a lot. I stopped you from running. One handed now does more damage. You know what? I like it. You hit hard, bro. You hit real hard. Holy Jesus. Sir. Sir. I'm 
Okay, well, he, he smacked me twice and I lost a lot of health, which for Tails, this battle is about to be very difficult. Um, I spent a point in my room. Well, hopefully, that's good. Enough. Chest here, it's a jewelry in it, and a nice ring. It's definitely fun, it's like an anime to get this fight with me. It's very helpful. Um, Cindy is out there, body is done. Grievances. Okay. Good hunting. Cindy, there was no other choice, my boy. There was no other choice. And the next time you hit me that <coughs> don't hit me like that no more. You don't ever hit me like that. You're already dead. How he killed these people wearing steel? Plot armor. That's all plot armor. Uh, but y'all got plenty of weight, so I can't even be mad at that. Hey, I'm taking that weak poison. Very useful. Very useful. But yeah, there's a certain armor. Let's check. Hey. Hey. That's kind of bad. I like the look of it. We got a face to it and all. And there's a certain helmet we can put on our head. I'm not one for helmets. I'm definitely not. But it is a light armor helmet. We'll check it out. Kind of got a little naked vibe going on here. It ain't too bad. But that helmet. That helmet's okay. I ain't gonna say it's that bad. But I'm not into helmets. I just hate them. I don't want to deal with it now, I guess. My buddy was beating the dust off of me. I had to use a whole potion. So we got a special piece of uh, chest armor anyway. Now we just need some special gauntlets and special boots. The boots necessarily don't have to be leather. But I would like them very much to be. I'm kind of getting up at this point. <laughs> Alright, so phase one of getting my character to a very good point is over with. And with that said, this episode is...